is a very easy machine to use. Power steering, perfect to use, steering wheel, fingertip control, everything you want in a roller, you've got it with the Mente. This machine is ideal for cross rolling. All wickets need cross rolling. And with the power steering, you can achieve this quite easily with the Mente. Right, the feathering effect of the barrel is rolled over while it's hot, and this allows you to join your different rolls up as you're rolling your wicket. And it's terribly important that we have a feathering effect. And this roll achieves that, because you're going to water the pitch, and it's going to be soft on the very top, so that when you do rolls, you're going to do a series of rolls, you're about three metres wide, so you need to be able to do a series of runs without leaving line. The only way you can achieve this is with this feathering effect. And we've, we're showing this just on the edge of the barrel there. Very important, needs to be done. You need to have it in your roller. This is a simple scraper bar. Um, it's used to uh, pick up the uh, soil that's picked up off the top of the wicket, get on the barrel, and you need to be able to scrape that off. Now, we have two forms of uh, scraper bar. We have the steel one that we've got here and we have a compound one. And both do the job handsomely. The only thing is that the compound one wears away a little bit faster. Okay, here we go. This is the ballasting area. We have a simple two inch BSP plug and this is where we fill the water from, right? Doesn't matter where you are in the world, you can get one of these plugs. Now, it pays to put a little bit of soluble oil in to your roller so that you protect the inside of it and it'll protect the grass when you're letting it go, providing you don't use it too strong. Some of the units have sand in them, some of them have concrete in them. That's enough, the concrete ones don't have any water ballast in them whatsoever. This is the disc brake, mainly used for uh, just locking the machine, of course, when it's uh, in a stationary position. It's automatic locking on the hydraulics in any case. So once you get back to neutral, you've got an automatic lock. But this is a little safety precaution. Um, it's a little hand operated one the other end and it just locks that disc there. Okay, this is how we lock the brake on for parking position. Has a serration here, push it forward. Just remember when you're finished, to unlock it and bring it off. Simple as that. Okay, what we need to know is how to set the speed. Has a speed controller on the motor. Just remember it's a cricket pitch roller and not a lawn mower. We need to have the quietest amount of speed going so that ergonomically it is ideal for the operator. So don't over rev, rev the engine. It's got enough power to do the job at low revs. This is a little added attraction. Every machine that Mente supplies has one of these or an Esky. And these go up the top where the wireless can go. Right up the back of where you're working, ideal. Great situation up here. Here at the Kerry Sports Complex, we have two Mente 2000 rollers on site, which will be used to maintain our full turf centre areas plus our practice wicket areas which will in turn help us produce high quality standard wickets. In regards to using the machine, in regards to the easy use of it, Father Boys and myself have loved every minute of it.